Alright, uh, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Guys, I don't know if you remember, I was actually making a game a while ago and my game programming course is only a couple of weeks away. So I decided that I'm going to maybe make this a little bit more frequent, just showing you that the skills that I've learned throughout the course and well this one will be just what I've learned by myself, but yeah, the, the skills I've learned at the course. It's a two year course, so maybe I'll post them weekly. I'm not too sure, but uh, this is the game that I started on. I'll go ahead and show you the first level. This is what the first level was like. I don't know if you remember, it looks like this and I've done quite a lot of modification to that level. I haven't actually touched this project for a while because I'm waiting for my new PC to arrive so I can actually start making games on Unreal Engine uh, as well as like CryEngine and all that but uh, yeah because I don't know. But this is what it looks like now. I've Everything I've done is uh, I've done so the horses and the sheep I've made even that little crappy little man there. I kind of forget on how to even do all this stuff because I haven't touched it for a while but uh, this is the main menu you'll probably get to see it if I've set it up so this is the main menu as you can see I don't think you can okay you can actually control the person I never really noticed if that was a thing probably should uh, fix that but that's uh, easily fixable anyway he fell off so yeah as you can see there's a few options it's called farm frenzy that was just just so I can put something there so I can click exit and no I don't want to exit the game if I click play it's gonna go ahead and show me a level one and then it's going to zoom on over and here is the actual game itself. So everything is the same. This is the end thing here. This barn is the end square, except it's just a little little barn now. Nothing too fancy. I'm not very good at animation or um, modeling or anything like that. So it's just some crappy looking stuff. Here is a horse that is running around. Um, it looks pretty shitty, but uh, that's okay. Look at the high graphic fences. <laughs> that is just a little hay bale. I don't know. Let's put that in there. But yeah, here's a sheep walking backwards and forth. Uh, I didn't bother to change the direction of him just because I found it easier. That was actually quite hard to change the direction on where the horse is looking. There's actually a invisible game object running just in front of him like this. So it actually keeps the direction where he's looking. I'm sure there's an easier way of doing it, but uh, I haven't figured it out yet. And as you can see, my player walks and when you click the button, his little tootsies move. Tootsies, who even says tootsies? His little feet move as well as his arms. And yeah, he's just a really, really bad looking farmer, basically. Um, but still, and I managed to make him look the way I'm looking. And I actually did that myself, so I was quite happy that I managed to code that in. Oh, oh we survived. So yeah, and I decided to add like a mountain up here. Nothing too fancy, just, uh, just basically a square for each little thing and... Wasn't too hard. That's actually not even in the right spot. Probably should uh, move that. But uh, yeah, I haven't really touched this project. Can you even? There you go. I haven't even touched this project for a while. I don't know. I just haven't really been bothered. But uh, yeah, as you can see, the spike trap is now mud instead. So it all runs the same. The walls and our fences and all that. I'll go ahead and show you. It's actually quite hard to beat. Just kidding. Um, but when I don't want to beat it, I don't. So that's back to the other crappy levels that I haven't finished or edited yet. But that is it. Hopefully you guys like the look of it. It obviously looks a lot better even if I am bad at animation. Remember, that's not my job to make these characters and all that crap. My job is to make the game run. Well, that's what I'm planning on doing. But I do like animation and all that. I quite enjoy that. So if I ever needed to, I could do that as well. I use Cinema 4D for everything. The, f uh, the fences, the horse, the sheep, the mud, and yeah, everything. If you're probably wondering what the mud is, it's just um, it's just uh, like a flat terrain looking thing. It's just terrain that I just put so it actually uh, just, just goes up enough so you see the top of it. And uh, yeah, reasonably easy. But uh, that is it. Uh, I haven't been working on it because I've been doing more stuff with... We'll go ahead and show you if I've got it up. I've been doing more stuff with uh, terrain. I did have a terrain one here. Is it this one? Can I open it up like this? I don't even remember how to. Um, file. Is it kind of like this? I'm not too sure. But yeah, I want to get into uh, Unreal Engine, but I can't yet because my computer is too crappy. But I've got a new computer on the way. Hopefully that arrives soon enough. So yeah, the difference is quite a lot. You can you can kind of tell that uh, that's not so not so good looking. But that's is that the first? Yeah, that was the first uh, first thing. Now is this the one? No, this isn't the one, but I was just doing some terrain test. That's actually all water. It doesn't look too good. Um, that's not the one. I'll go ahead and try and find the one. I just got out of it. God damn it. Uh, no, that's how I do it. i got to go file open. I will keep you guys, because I've got a few, so I can show you a few of them. Now, I believe it was, was it testing? 
I was going to work on a horror game just to do the terrain, but I decided, well, I tried, but the terrain just doesn't look too good in Unity. That's my issue. I've downloaded heaps of packs and even bought a few assets, but they still don't look too good. So that's why I'm jumping onto Unreal Engine, just because it looks a lot better. I'm going to come back to you guys when I found the... Oh, uh, revert factory settings. That uh, doesn't really matter. That's just the review uh, layout. But is this the one? If not, I'll have to come back to you guys. It still could be. It just might be somewhere else. Is that it down there? No. Uh, this ain't the one. So I'm going to go ahead and look for it and I'll be right back. Alrighty. So I don't quite remember what I was trying to do here, but uh, it looks pretty dark. I think I was going for a horror theme, but I think this is a bit too dark. I guess I, I think I was trying out skyboxes. That's what I was trying to do. As you can see, it's way too dark. I was going for fog as well. Can I, walk? I can even walk through the trees. Nice. But uh, this is not what I was looking for. But I thought I'd show you anyway. I think we need to turn up the brightness because that is a bit too bright. Jeez, do I even remember how to turn up the brightness? Um, I've got the, everything's set out wrong here. So I think all we need is just to add a directional light. So we'll go ahead and add that. There we go. That makes it a little bit better. We still want it to look a bit dark. So we'll rotate that. There we go. So yeah, let's have a look at it now. Doesn't actually look too bad. It's not the worst looking stuff. Maybe the fog could do better. I definitely don't like that sky. That needs to be changed. But yeah, the fog will go ahead and remove. See if that looks a little bit better. Now, is it in... I'm pretty sure it is in a separate window that we actually have to bring up here. It is called... Where is it? Let's see if we can even... Is it Inspector? No, it's an Inspector. Light lighting I think it's no I've got that up I don't even remember how to do it it's like a legit a box that just says fog there we go fog All right. so that'll make it a little bit better looking well just so we can actually see in the distance um, but still yeah the, the sky box looks absolutely shocking doesn't look like a sky at all um, especially with how the terrain looks and considering there is light hitting the ground like what is this it's night time why is there a light on the ground <laughs> there should not be any light to consider. Well, actually, I guess it could be the moon. But, I don't know. Maybe, do we have... Probably because of the directional light shining on it. It needs to be, a, like, a darker... Yeah. We need... we need You need a light, but you need it to be not shining. Okay, I think I know how to do that. When I say I think I know, I think I should know how to do that. I should just pop it. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that's not how it's going to go. Anyway, that's just something I was working on. That wasn't the one I was working on, though. I had one where I had buildings and all that as well. Uh, I'll try and find it for you guys. Alrighty, so this is the one that I was looking for. It will, I actually did click on this before, but I just uh, couldn't find it for you. But this is it's nothing to... Can I, I hate the uh, zoom in feature. So it zooms really slow, and then it will go really quick. Um, okay, so here it is. Are the textures all fucked? No, I don't think they are. But this is the crappy looking little town thing we got going on. We'll go ahead and play. Oh, come, okay, great. We got errors, do we? What have we got errors for? God, everything's so wrong. Move over here. Down here. Down here. Good boy. What do we got? Probably because there's a uni uh, an assets folder missing. But you can see what it is. It's just a crappy looking... Oh, I know why. There was these white things are all... Bushes. I didn't tell anything. I don't think so. I don't know. But uh, as you can see, looks reasonably cool. I just didn't do anything with it. I tried to build some mountains, but the mountains look like dog shit. Sorry for the dogs. But yeah, guys, that is what I've been working on. I'm just going to show you that. Hopefully, when I come back, I'll be on my new PC and I can show you some Unreal Engine and all that. So yes, that's Ellie. She's coming home in two days. But anyway. Guys, hope you did enjoy this. Hopefully you want to see more and hopefully I can learn some more stuff in the future. Thank you for watching, guys. Peace. Now, how do I click stop? Peace, peace, peace.